thought about it all day today. The world we know is about to waste away. On both sides and in between, we're seeing things that we've never seen. Out in a piece of paradise, it's turning out to be nice. We've been seeing some weird things. You've been peeking in the window for nothing tonight. Yeah. <laughs> Wait a minute. What were we seeing? It looked like a fish tank. What were we seeing? Yeah. Mm. Run in the house. Yeah. Something, like I said, it flashed in my eyes. We were feeling stuff, but we were just like, well, we're just going to hang out until he comes home. Then light flashes. So I'm seeing a little flash, and I'm going, what is that? And like, I'm asking these guys, you see this? She's seen right. one of them. Uh -huh. She actually seen one of, like, maybe, what, ten? And then the last flash I saw was like, no sights of origin, just the flash light. And then right. the last one went right in my face. My eyes are watering. I was like shaking through my body, and I'm like, what was that? So that just happened, what, about ten minutes, 10 minutes before minutes. you guys got here? Oh, wow. So, I mean, I'm still like, my heart's calming. Right. Yeah, it's calming. I deal with stuff in this house. You ain't got a clue. I've had preachers and Holy Ghost field and prayer cloths. And I believe you, man. Actually, the names of things in here that I'm not to talk about. I have a question. Okay, they said that the doors were painted red. Did you just paint over them? Yeah. Okay. So there used to be a wall right here. Like I can show you where the wall is at. See the wall? See this here? Yeah. See how where I tore this wall out? Yeah. They were flat right blocks. Then. You know what I'm talking about? Flat blocks. And actually the wall come right here where I'm standing. When you come in this door, right. this door's painted red. There was another door. There was a wall. They had the blocks. Went to the ceiling. I've redone all this. When you come in, there was a fire extinguisher right here. It was a plastic cross hanging over top of the fire extinguisher. That was okay. poured yeah. on all four cross. Yep, just like that. So it was a Celtic. Hanging from the cross was a set of bells. Off of the cross? Off of the cross. There was four bells. In a row hanging on down? A, on a string. No, they was all together. On a string. Oh, like this? What, from point to point of the cross? Yeah, like a necklace. Like the yeah. cross is here and it's from here to here? Yeah, they, they yeah. was a string mm -hmm. hanging from the cross. And the material the bells on. I was having a lot of problems. Bell Jingle time. bells, round, like a Christmas bell. There was four of them. Uh, my pastor at the time when I was in church, Brother Darrell and Steve, come into the house. I was told to burn the cross and bury the bells. Mm -hmm. Oh, you did? Or I choose. And I did. I had to dig a hole, burn the cross, bury the bells. This one was red. This one was red. This one when you was say red. red inside and out? Yeah, both sides. Yeah. Well, no, I'm sorry. This door was not red. This door was red. And this door was red when it was here. This the door, door was not. Door. This door was white. This yeah. one was okay. the only two in the house that was red. This one and the one that was here. So what does that mean with the two red doors coming in, like entrance doors? It's witchcraft. Witchery. Mm -hmm. I'll tell you right now, it's witchcraft. Now, the cross wasn't that important. The bells was given to somebody that lived in this house by a witch. I was in church. I'm not in church right now at this time. I'm not even claiming that I'm in church. If I die right now, I'm going to hell. I'm not going to say that. I do have a discernment, which is a gift from God, whether I'm a sinner. It's even worse when I'm in church. I've had it since I was 15 years old. I can detect stuff. Most of the time, it's just children. So there's a girl spirit you sense in here, too? There's a little girl. There's a little girl. There's a little girl. She's probably about 12 or 13 years old. Is there any kind of death that's happened in this house that you know of? Oh, yeah. From my experience, the man that built the house died in this house. Do you know where where he died in here? Yeah. Where? In the living room. In the living room. Do you know how he Where died? the couch is sitting at. Just in front of the natural. It's right here. Uh -huh. um, this is the man that built the house. It's still in here. Anytime I do any remodels and stuff, he shows up as a shadow. He don't really cause no harm. He just tries to scare you. The little girl has followed me from every place that I live. Why she follows me, I don't know. She's got she's a, short she's cut she's hair. To you. She's got with a white dress on. Uh, I don't know. So she's you've seen her. Me. She's she's following. Oh, she's I, attached she, to I you. I have physically seen her. The kitchen was open like this. The bathroom had an open door. I literally seen that little girl. I sat and watched her walk by me with her hand on the kitchen counter top and turned around and looked at me. 
Yeah. We heard like that. something scratching across this window here. No, I don't know. And I heard happened. something. Is there anything there that makes that noise, like keys scraping across that? Because I heard mm. something like if you drop your keys and just like <laughs> like that, like that. That's what I heard. That's what I heard. The dude that owns a house makes noise. What's the story in here? Um, when I first moved in, I kept hearing uh, noises, and I just kind of ignored it. He told me about things that was happening in the house, and of course, who's yeah. this person did? Preston did. Um, we have the prayer cloth over the doors and the windows, and I questioned him about because I didn't know, and neither did the kids, of what was going on. He had priests that come in and tried to anoint, uh, you know, the house, and try right. to get, I guess, the evil spirits or whatever out. Here one night, um, it was me, my youngest daughter, uh, my oldest daughter, my son, and uh, my friend's uh, daughter. Um, the girls was getting ready to get in the shower late at night. I was in uh, the bedroom, just had walked out of here. I got all the laundry out of the dryer, went to the bedroom. The girls was in the back room, the middle bedroom. Um, it was just like a big wham bang. And we didn't know what it was. A bang? A bang, yes. It sounded like it was back here somewhere. This towel had rolled up. The ashtray flung off in the Tumble floor. That. that was the big wham bang. From this end. It just rolled it all up into like a little tube. Yeah, and it fell down in between. Really? Yeah. Point one, point, point two. Little girl. Point okay, three. We're getting, the living room. we're getting hits on the um, bell meter right now. Point three it is right now. Point two. So we said point, okay, We when we got here we said, if there's an incubus, point one. If it's a if succubus, go point two. And I said, and if it's both, make point it point one. three. Point two. It's probably going to go to point three. It's point three now. Is this point three? <laughs> point three. Like these pictures, every morning we got to turn the pictures because they like cart sideways. Where did the guy die in here? So do you know what he, what did he die of? Natural causes. Natural causes died right here. Let's come over here with the needle. Look at that picture. And I straightened it before I left the house. Look, it turns every night. Come here. Mm -hmm. See my angel pictures? Yeah. Now, which one's turned? That one on the bottom. Yep. I'll straighten it every single day. Now, do me a favor and slam a door or something. I just want to see if it makes it move. Let's just debunk it and see if it... No, it ain't going to move. It's a solid concrete floor. This house does move. not have any shake to it at all. This is solid. Right. The fish tank was off. I cut it on when we first came in the house. Can when you I see that fish tank at all on the back door? No. no. There's a blue light that was... Well, what, what were we seeing? Can you see blue light, any kind of a street light that's a blue tint to it through any of these blinds? Nope. I know what you've seen. What were we seeing? You know what you've seen. I saw something in here just now. That's the master bedroom. Yeah, we have an attic, too. But it does run in high. Let me just stick it in here for a little bit. Because I felt something there. Point one. Point four. Point seven. Point seven. Point nine. One point oh. You got a light here? Are you getting that? 1.1? 1.2? 1.3? We are getting, getting hits on the melt meter. Um, I felt something in this room. And there's the 1. proof. 1.4. It's going up, up, up. What is that? Turn the volume down. The man that built the house is still here. 1.3. Yeah, something, something's here. Mm -hmm. Something's right in here. Right. But if you look at my bedroom, a Jesus picture is everyone. Point five. Yeah, 1.5. One night I was laying in bed and it's I running, felt huh? like that something was holding it's me running. down it's in the bedroom. Can we go in there? Yeah, go ahead. Turn go on on. Look at all the Jesus pictures. Turn them, turn them on. We have the fan on. So now it's at a zero. Look. look. Yeah. It's hiding. It is hiding now. You. Yep. I told you it was, it was right here. Come and back I, here again. When I lay right Look here, at all the pictures. I Look. sleep on this side of the bed, and he sleeps. I tell you when it runs in house. On that side of the bed, so and I'm telling you, I have a good it was room. like the covers. I had the covers on me. It was in the middle of the night, and it was just holding me down. Something holding me down. You were awake. And I woke up, and I was trying to sit up, and I couldn't sit up. Point seven. I can run it down, but it does run in high school the house. For real. What time are we getting to right now? Point three right here. Point We're at 133. Let me see. Point five. I'll show you where it's at. Follow me. 
Oh, wow, I just had a 16.4. I told you what it's at. I'm telling you right here. I told you it runs in hands. So she was outside and she felt something pushing on her chest again. Mm -hmm. It does run. It runs in and out. Do you want to take this again? I don't know what's in the attic. I kind of want to poke my head up there. I want to check this out. Here, you know what? Come here. I want to poke my head up here. I just want to see what it feels like. Here, you want to see what it feels like. Here, you want to see what it feels like. Here, you want to see what it feels like. Here, you want to take these? Oh, where went? Here, take one and hand one to Alicia or something. I hate these kind of stairs. Here, give me a um millimeter. Yeah. You got a flashlight, anybody? Where did you find the point one? Wait. Oh. Is anything up here? Here, give me that camera. Something just shut this light off on me. Something is totally messing with this light. This light hasn't had a problem all night. Now oh, it's we like just put new batteries in it. it's totally going off. This is taking the light right out of it. Who's up here? Talk on this camera. Who's here with us? Where did you find the picture? You see this light going off? I got a light that if I feel me turn it on. Let me turn it on. Let me turn it on. Should I go all the way up? Let me turn the light on up there? Yeah, you got a light. Do you have to come up to do it? No, I got to go back here and do it. Oh. I'll show you where I found the picture, though. Can you make a noise up here? If anybody's up here with me, can you make a noise? Okay, now we got some light. Where was that picture? There was a picture. There was a picture. There was a picture. There was a picture found up here in this attic of a woman, and it was face down in the insulation. And, um,. He was told to burn the picture, and the picture did not want to burn. If anybody's here, can you touch me? If, I, if, I, if, I, we're about point to where about where it would be, where it would have been. Over here. So this is where the witch's picture was found. Yeah. We can call it a witch's picture, right? He was a witch. Yeah, right here. Because it, that's why it wouldn't burn. Yeah. I was in church at the time, and I was told to come up here. And I've been up in this attic for almost two years. So you know that there wasn't a picture up here before, and then all of a sudden you come up and you found it. It was face down. Like the picture. Like if was looking, looking at, at you downstairs, kind of like. Down, yeah. That's right over where that couch is where that guy died. Yep. Yeah. So that right there, now was that the previous owner before you? Yes. Well, I tried to burn it, but it ended up burning. So like that that picture was facing down where where the previous owner died. Yeah. Of supposedly natural causes, which really makes you wonder, what is that? 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 But everything in here runs in hands. Yeah, usually it does. So they told you to burn the picture? Burn somebody the picture? Told me, well, somebody told me. You, you got the intuition to burn it. Yes. And it didn't want to burn. Burn, but it took me. It, it was a heavy set lady in a black dress. She had long black hair. Well, yeah. that sounds like a witch, doesn't it? Just like a classic witch. It was a witch. I don't know what it was. I believe you. I believe you. I mean, like, I've already had the strangest things happening. Right. It doesn't like light? Mm -mm. So when you turn the lights on, it, It'll it rise. goes away. Well, let's shut some lights down and kind of maybe use some flashlights. We need okay. to grab a couple flashlights. Here, you want to hold that one? Do you got your headlight? So should we kill the lights and maybe film that way? So today is Thursday night, early Friday morning. What, about 2 o'clock? Yes, 157. I am. I'm going to do a ghost box session here. Um, if anybody's here with us, can you tell us your name? 
Did you just say Seth again? No, I just said Seth. Did you say Seth? So it said Seth twice now and I've asked it. Right. Is that a name you recognize, Preston? Uh, I don't know who is here. I mean, four I do. Two o'clock in the morning on what day? Just to get ready? <laughs> ready for what? What town are we in right now? I heard Crumpler. Did you hear that? What's the owner's name? Did it say Warner? Did it say it? Yeah. First and last? Yeah. I'm pretty sure it did. So what's the name of what's in this house? Did you hear say Seth again? Yeah. Now, for it to say it, every time I ask what's the name here, something here is Seth. I'm going to say something is, something is, something is, something is probably the name Seth. 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 Here, identify yourself. You don't know the, the previous owner's last name, or do you? Mm-hmm. What is it? Jones. Is Jones here with us? The natural. The guy that built the house, that actually built the house, is the one that's here. I don't know his name. You don't know his name? What was the guy's name who built this house? That might be Seth. Adam. Did you bring Adam? Ken over there. I heard Seth again. Is Seth the name of the person who built this house? I heard yes or Seth. What is Preston? What is Preston? What is Preston? Is there anything upstairs in that attic? What's in this house? Incubus or succubus? Who's the succubus? I want to know your name. You can see how fast the numbers are changing uh-huh. going through these stations, see? Yeah. It's sweeping so fast that when you hear something, I mean, look at it. It's going so fast that when you hear like a, a whole sentence of all in the same voice. Right. Then you know it's doing something. What is Leah's last name? You said castle, I said castle. Yeah, it says clearly that. is a bell right after you said it. Who painted the doors red? Who painted the doors red? Who painted the doors red? Who painted these doors red on this house?
Why was them doors painted red? If you guys got any questions, I'm gonna let you guys ask it. Preston, you got some questions? I'm gonna let you guys ask. I'm gonna let you guys ask. I'm gonna let you guys ask. your name? Dogs, animals are very sensitive to this stuff too. Yeah. And I, I know they are. Sometimes she will go crazy and bark too. In a corner that nobody's there. Yeah. Or uh -huh. something. Yeah. We had a, a cat that actually just disappeared <laughs> within the last week. What is the name of the little girl who follows Preston everywhere he goes? I heard one voice and they go, I don't know. Tell me the name of the little girl, the young girl who's been seen here. What was it? What was it? Say the name. Otherwise, this is Heather. Heather? Do you feel like how uh, Heather is possibly a, a relative? Yeah. Like a cousin? Mm -hmm. That's what I get a feel too. And what did she die of? Okay. Oh, sad. I want that succubus to identify yourself. I heard Dina. And I've heard Dina a few times tonight. Yeah. Tell me the name of the incubus. Seth. Seth. I'm just really glad we stuck around. Right. I know it was trying to get us to leave. It was trying to freak me out. <laughs> Uh -huh. It was trying to like get in my face. It tried to it tried to get me running, but I don't run. Who got up in my face with that white light? Oh. You just said stop again. Mm -hmm. I've woken up at the same time you know, like at the foot of the bed and just like ran out of the room. Yeah. Who did I see that ran out of the bedroom one night when I got woken? Who ran out of the bedroom the night I got woken that was standing at the foot of the bed? What's your name? I heard the Z word that he mentioned to me the other night. Did you hear that one too? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Preston, did you hear it? Mm -hmm. You reacted to it because I heard it too. Yeah. I've, I've run into that one before. Right. We've seen that one at the portal. Did you hear the name? You know the one I'm talking about? Mm -hmm. Yeah. We've encountered that one before. What's that demon's name? Is he okay? Mm-hmm. Okay, I have a jump. I have a jump. And you know its name? Yep. What's its name? I can't tell you. Can you write it down? No. The fact that they practice witchcraft here, is that why the incubus and succubus is here? No. Why do you think it's here? It has an attachment to something in the past. Do you think it's following you, Preston? Yeah. Do you think it's following you? No. 
from before here? No. Yeah. You said yeah. For how long? I get a, I get a feeling it's in there mm -hmm. towards the bedroom and the bathroom and whatever the other room is back there. Yeah. I'm going to just walk over here with the mel meter and here. Is it? Yeah, point 0.1, point 0.3, point 0.4, point 0.3, point 0.2, point 0.1. Are you hiding? Zero. Took off. And <laughs> was there a, a point 0.3 right here? Coming back from here? It was right there for sure. Who moves the angel? Who moves the angel in this? Who's this? Uh, your father? Great grand, uh, grandparents. 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 Who moves the pictures in this house? That's a good question for the ghost box. Let's turn that back up. I want to know who's moving the pictures. Who moves the pictures in this house? Philip. Didn't we get Philip before too? Yeah. Are you feeling something in there, Preston? That's where it is, isn't it? Yeah. Let's walk in here a little bit. Where is it? Let's go find it. Point two. Point two zero. Right when we came in that door, mm -hmm. it gave us a point two. Yeah. I'll tell you something weird too. You said like the with the I'm sorry with the smells you get. And when I went in that bathroom, it was like for an instant a real strong smell of urine, and you were saying that, but then it was gone. It's not <laughs> like it's a dirty house; it's a clean house. Mm -hmm. I smelt it when I was in the bathroom for a moment, and then it was gone. Mm -hmm. Point three. Point three. Point five, point seven, point five. Are you in the attic? Point four, point five, point four, point two. You guys got something going on here. Mm -hmm. Absolutely. Have you guys ever seen like flashes of light like in the corner of your eyes? Uh, yeah, I have seen it. Like um, just like a weird little light yeah. lighting up. Uh -huh. Or like just a little circle or something. Like, like a shooting shoot? Yeah. Get glances and real stuff. Fast. Yeah, real fast. Corner of your eye a lot. Mm -hmm. Off to the side. Yes. Because um, I've never had that happen to me. Right. With that weird flashing. Like 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 that flash that she just did. Right. Kind of like off to the side. Mm -hmm. What is that? Are you shaking? What's shaking here? Are you shaking? Mm-mm. Tell me the name of the witch who was in the attic. Tell me now. What's the witch's name whose picture was found in the attic? Dana. Did it say Dina? Dana or Dina? If anybody's here with us, can you make the meter number on the meters go up? It definitely runs in high. Mm -hmm. Is he talking? Mm -hmm. Who's he talking to? I don't know. Let me go see what he's doing. Preston's in here. And something's messing with him, clearly. Who are you talking to? Which we'll one see. is it? We'll see. Ain't that he says he's just talking to himself. Talking to himself. 
I can understand that. They mess with him really bad. Too. Oh, I, I know, I know they do. Yeah, I can, I can understand what he's going through. I just felt a cool breeze right here. When you guys see the footage of what we did outside, uh -huh. it's some pretty wild stuff. What would you call that, Leisha? Mm -hmm. I mean, I explained it. What would you it call it? It went through that? you. You think? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So, you know, if he's going through this on a, on a daily or a regular basis, even weekly, I mean, that's going to wear you down after a while. Oh, yeah. Stress, depression, all kinds of, all kinds of stuff. stuff. So what is it? What is, um, what is it that you guys feel out in the backyard there? Because we heard some noises coming from out there too. Me and uh, me and Preston hear a lot of stuff back there. Um, I've actually thought of seeing somebody at the edge of the woods and the fence back there. Like a black shadow person? Yeah. My friend. Is it nighttime here. or daytime? Um, it was at nighttime. Uh, it was late at night. Um, I know it was after midnight. I'm not sure the exact time. How did you see it with a flashlight? Um, we were actually sitting in her vehicle. Um, we was outside um, for a little bit, and we were sitting in the vehicle, and we turned around, and I thought it was like somebody standing there, a man or something. Um, so I ran back in the house. Uh, she got out of the vehicle, um, come in behind me, and I come to wake Preston up, uh, which he, um, I thought was asleep. He was just laying across the bed, and I grabbed the gun, and I went back outside, and he come back. So you thought there was a person there? Yeah, we actually thought it was a person. We're not sure what it was, but we didn't Did see you see any details of the person at all? Um, just, it was dark. So you've seen um, the form of a person? Yeah, just the form of a person. Was that way up in the back there? Yes, near the fence. No, as far as you said you've heard noises out there, was it voices, sticks breaking, footsteps? I mean, what kind of noises have you heard out there? Um, noises like that, um... Plus, when we were walking the road one day, um, we seen the baby doll that looked like someone had sacrificed a baby doll. A baby um, doll? It may a doll? Still, yes. It may be uh, still up there. Um, it had um, its legs and uh, arms and things, you know, that's torn off. Oh, really? And it looked like... Um, was it like, like somebody blood? attacked it? Right. Somebody. In blood? That's what it looked like. Like red... Stuff on, it? stuff on it, yeah. What kind of a, bo a doll? Tall um, would it be? How big of a doll? How big would you think, Preston? That baby doll? Mm. Like the size of a little yeah. baby? Yeah. Like yeah. the size of an infant? Pro probably about the size of an infant, yeah. So a re realistic size. size baby. Right, like a little baby. Right. I had a lot of things happen to me out there. Just remember that I, at one point, have you ever felt like something pushing on your eyeballs? Yeah. Like, and mine ooh. water constantly in the house. Your eyes water? Mm -hmm. Oh yeah, something something got my eyes water and you can ask these guys. No, I do constantly. I've got that and on film. And I thought it was just allergy, but I'm not so sure that no. it's that because no. this is like every day. Yeah, uh, what, what watered my eyes is not right. an allergy. So. And I do get the feeling there's something in here that's watching me. I try not to pay attention to it, but... And going about my business, because right. especially when the kids are yeah, here. you get you don't want to give it power. Them and, yeah, and and the fear feeds it. Yes, they love it when they scare you. Yeah, they feed off. When they get a rise, you know, then that just fuels them. Right. Right. What's that? I'm not sure. Actually, um, the TV, the actual box that I. Have. That's exactly what it sounds like. The remote is right here. Look, I will show you. This is the remote. Watch this. What is that now? And it just went off. And it turned itself off. And it turned itself off. Look. Now what's in here? No, Stop making a noise here. Rather. What's in here? What's in here? Point two. Point nine. Point three. Point one. What's in here? I'm gonna go in the laundry room for a second. What did Leah see in here? Can you come and make some numbers go up on this meter? Who rolls this towel up? We got a, right in that threshold where you got that second red door. Uh -huh. We got a point nine. Wow. So I mean right there, so something was there. Right. 
things are. Okay. <laughs> I've been getting touched like crazy lately. Angie, our camera person, had a um, an incident, and it was on her chest. No. Yeah. Weighing her chest down. We all felt something here, didn't we? I don't have a K2 meter because the demon smashed it on me the other night. He's asleep, but we're still going to film him. Mm -hmm. <laughs> He's going to be on TV. I'm worried. Sound asleep. As long as he doesn't snore, we're not going to give him a hard time. <laughs> so we're sitting outside from 9.30 to 1 o'clock in the morning. Right. It was actually intensifying. Mm -hmm. I think it was intensifying because it wanted us out of here. It did right. not want us in here. Mm. So at least you know you'll have evidence. That's right. Something's here and you're not crazy. Mm. It's going to retaliate. It's going to retaliate? Mm. What do you think it'll do? Something to you? Yeah. In your dream? In your sleep? It's going to get you in your sleep? Is that what you're thinking? Yeah. I'm going to see. I pick up on some stuff. I know what to do. I know it's not very godly, that's for sure. It's right. not a happy yeah. thing. Right. It doesn't want to do any good. Let's put it that way. Yep. What time is it right now? Oh, it's after three already? Mm -hmm. Do you feel that? Mm -hmm. That we went from like two right. something to three ten? Three ten? Right. That's weird because we've yeah. had that happen. Oh. Is it out? I thought something come up to me right there. Will you leave this house? No. Why are you here? Who are you attracted to here? Who are you attracted to in this house? I thought I heard it. Why are you here? Who are you attracted to here? Who are you attracted to in this house? Why are you here? Who are you attracted to here? Who are you attracted to in this house? I thought I heard it. You want us to leave? Yes. Yeah. Yeah. people? Who are the witches? Tell us what the other witches are named. Gretchen? Where in this house do you like to hide? you want to follow him everywhere he goes. Some people are just like natural beacons that draw him in. Right. And I think he's, he is one of those. He don't like to talk about a lot and he won't say hardly any names. He tells me, you know, that it's best that we don't talk about it in the house. I got 1.5. It went up to 1.5. It went back to zero. Yeah. Running and hiding. Right. Who's messing with the pictures here? So with his sensitivity and the history on this house, that's a perfect storm for a lot of activity. So it is um, about 4 o'clock now. We want to thank you guys for joining us. And we'll see you next time. Bye. Bye. We all cry. Yeah.